such an abundance of ether. Are we in luck? We are. This is an elegant artifact, most likely built to regulate the flow of ether. I strongly suspect the ancients used it to stem the flow from here to the burn. That would explain how they were able to untether what became Aziz La from its surroundings. But were we to throw open the floodgates, the resultant deluge would surely be sufficient to raise our wall. And in restoring the flow, we may also restore life to the wasteland. Hmm. What is it? While the device itself harbors a surfeit of ether, the opposite is true of the surrounding area. An effect of regulation, perhaps. A similar phenomenon seemed to be occurring in Doma. Whatever the explanation, the answer will not reveal itself here. We have seen what we needed to see. Let us return to Mol Illo. Hmm. That's interesting. Alright, let's head back then. This not uh, this time not heading up to the skybox. Well, it looks like I was right about the pillars. Now all we need is permission to use them. That such an abundance of ether should lie undisturbed for millennia. Tis a miracle made possible by the steppe's long history of isolation. Yeah, okay, so something came to mind just then. I want to bring it up before we continue. The abundance of ether is actually quite dangerous. For the amount that your stroller sure described is there, if used irresponsibly, it could summon a primal... Well, potentially rivaling the lights of Bahamut from the sounds of it. And there was talk of a calamity coming. Or the... The crystals of the surrounding area are being drained of elemental aspect, aspect uh, elementally aspected, well, ether. So that's a worrying sign. You found that which you seek, then. Great, great indeed is the Dusk Mother's power. If not less will su suffice to perfect, protect our lands. The blessing of the other tribes must now be sought. Of course, but to which tribes should we appeal? There are many who worship Namar, but none are so fervent in their faith as the, as the Dathal. Their consent shall be the key. The Dathal least spoke of them. A warlike tribe possessed of unique customs and beliefs. I sense their co cooperation will not be easily won. Nay, but it will be well worth the effort. The Dathal the 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 fear nothing, death least of all, and our alliance will be greatly strengthened by their presence. Let us go to Dathal Kar and treat with the Katun or Hatun, Sadu. Yeah! Ah, oh, I love Serena. Actually, you know what? I want a different mount. If we're going to be flying to the other side, let's go for you. Since I've actually got the music turned on right now. Bah, 
bam 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 ba ba da ba da ba da ba da da I know I could have teleported, but meh. Bam 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 bam. Do 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 do. So something interesting while we're flying. That was quite funny for me. I sort of discovered, thought of the concept of that the Dusk Mother and the Dawn Father turned out to actually be, most likely, Bahamut and Tiamat. I was very proud of myself for this. And then I looked it up online and there's quite a lot of people discussing this. So I figured this out a little bit late. Still very pleased with myself. Oh, it's a fate. I was thinking you were weirdly cl clustered out together. I'm here! Despite her fondness for battles, Sadu is an astute leader. If we plead our case in earnest, I'm certain she can be persuaded. Great faith gives rise to great strength, for better or worse. Whatever it is that Dathal holds sacred, we would do well to accord it all respect. You again! The other matters demand our time. Oh god. I'll add that in in a second. Alas, not. Quite the opposite, in fact. Talking, always talking. You say the pillars hold great power? Of course they do. They are the source of Namar's strength. To, to the Dathal, no place is more sacred. And we will make ash of any who would defile it. Though I see this is not your wish. Uh, you see the wisdom of our proposition then. You will join hands with us? I said nothing of joining hands. You wish to wield the Mars power to defend these lands, and this I will allow. But for leaving the step to fight the men in iron, I would have something in return. Namely? Namely, battle with you, Khan. The Dadam ended ere it began. I would face you again. Alone, without distractions. Defeat me, prove yourself the stronger, and you shall have the Dathal as your allies. Surely you are agreeable. Surely these are agreeable terms. Well, this is not on wholly unexpected turn of events, though I had assumed I would be the one required to fight. Alas, the Khatun has made, or Khatun has made her choice. Shall we dance? Ha! It shall be a battle the step shall not soon forget. Ah, already my soul burns brighter. Prepare yourself, Khan. And await me outside the car. Outside the car. I will gather my witnesses to join you anon. Ba 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 ba. Oh, I like the sound of this. Why are you still here? Go wait for me outside the car. Beep beep. I will join you soon enough. Ba 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 ba. Ba, 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 da, ba. Ooh, it actually is a battle. Excellent. 
When I was little, I would stride up to Gosetsu, wooden sword in hand, and challenge him. To his great credit, he never held back, and I had many a bump and bruise to show for it. <sighs> Try as I might, I fail to see the logic in this arrangement. I can but conclude there is none. All right, the will of the moon. Yes, this spot shall serve as well as any. I shall enjoy this Han. Is this truly necessary? Have you no peaceable way of making decisions? Speak not of peace! You stand before proud warriors of the Dathal. In the heat of battle do our souls burn brightest! We lay low the strong that we may rise higher! That is our way! The way of might! There is no other! Oh, they do not want for conviction. <laughs> Indeed. It's what makes them such dangerous enemies. And such useful allies. Enough talk! It is time to fight! And fight I shall! No idea what to expect. Black Mage Magic. Come, Khan, let us dance. You are strong indeed, a worthy champion of the steppe, but you are mistaken if you think I will fall so easily. you is pure bliss. Such sweet pleasure I will not suffer to end so soon. That is all you have. My soul demands more, Khan. Give me more. <laughs> I like how Carbuncle just took her out. In death do our souls sing.
<sighs> my arms grew heavy, my eyes dim, but so long as my life blood flows, I will fight on. Ah! How it burns! Come, let us begin anew. Sixty seconds to meet your impact. <laughs> this is the reckoning, Khan. One must fall. Just begun. Enough! You were not granted leave to set the step ablaze. Well, well, the sun has come out to play. Be gone, Moonstruck Oranir! I am busy! Fool of a Dothal! Have you forgotten the face of your master already? The sun will never set! From his seat on high, he reigns over all, now and forever! Yet what should he find here? But a battle to determine the fate of the steppe. A battle waged without his blessing. This will not stand. You, Doman! You who come to petition the warriors of this land, forget that all Nama's children are wards of the Oranir. As first among my brothers, your petition is mine alone to judge. These words are as wind from a horse's backside. Plentiful, but your act sings more sweetly. Let her speak for you. Insolent child, you will learn your place. Forgive me, Brother Magni, but we have an arrangement with the Dothal. We will not abide any interruptions. <laughs> so be it. The sun will pass judgment on all. Didacul, join me. Yeah, now things are getting going. The sun is in good company. We may dance alone. Beg not for mercy, for you will have none. Bear witness to the power and the glory of Azim! Constantly at each other's throats like rabid dogs. God, I'm turning into her. <laughs> <clears throat> I am not the patience for this, but if we must fight, let us at least be brief. Come. In the coming battle, you will fight as your staller. Will I now? <laughs> 